During the first seasonal operation, set the control knob to pilot, then hold down on the control knob for three to five minutes. This allows the air in the manifest to clear completely. During normal operation, you will only need to hold the control knob down on pilot for about five seconds. During the first use, it can take up to 10 minutes to clear air out of a newly installed gas line by holding down the pilot and the igniter. With the control knob set to pilot, push down on both the igniter button and the control knob simultaneously until ignition can be heard. Continue to hold down both buttons for at least 15 seconds until the pilot is touching the thermocouple and is noticeably heated. Release both buttons. Should the pilot go out, repeat steps two and three. Once the pilot flame is stable, turn the knob counterclockwise from the pilot setting to the desired number setting. This should be done slowly in one motion without stopping between positions. The control knob will only turn if you have a stable pilot light. During the very first use, leave the pilot on for several minutes prior to turning on the burner. The heater will now operate normally. You should adjust the control knob to your desired heat setting. Room temperature will vary based on individual room size and installation. Allow the heater to run on high to bleed all of the air until a blue flame is visible. Some yellow tipping can occur, but it should not be continuous. Blue waves typically occur during initial ignition as the gases take some time to heat the ceramic plaques. Once the plaques turn orange, then the burner will become stable. The time to reach stability often depends on how cold the air is. For efficiency, our wall heater comes with a built-in thermostat. The control has settings 1, or low, through 5, high, which determine how long the burner will stay on to reach your desired temperature. There is no exact temperature setting on the heater because each room size is different, so you will need to run the heater at a specific setting to determine what temperature the number on the dial gives you for your unique space. The copper bulb, located on the back of the heater, can be adjusted, if needed, to provide even better accuracy. Please keep in mind that if the thermostat has reached the temperature of a particular setting, the burner will remain off until the room cools. For example, setting 2 may only keep the pilot on if the room is warm enough. To stop the heater, shut off the safety valve on the gas inlet line. Next, turn the heater's control knob to the off position. 